Hey, it's Paul. Today what I want to do is I want to talk about fear. Fear is that one thing that seems to hold so many people back. Fear of mon losing money. Fear of what people think about them. Fear of whatever, right? There's, there's all kinds of fears. And unfortunately, too many people allow that to keep them stuck, prevent them from having success. So what I want to do today is I want to talk about uh, how to overcome fear, a two-step process of how to overcome fear so you can start having the success that you want to have and not have those fears hold you back anymore. Now, there are two fears that we are born with that, you know, just instinctively we have. One is fear of falling and the other one is fear of loud noises. Now, these fears are present because they're there to keep us alive. If we didn't have a fear of falling, we'd just fall, right? And then we wouldn't last very long. And loud noises are to keep us out of danger, fear of loud noises. So these are the only two fears that we are really genetically wired with, we were born with. The rest of the fears are all made up. So we learn them from our parents, our teachers, what we listen to, what we see, experience in our lives, these kind of things. And they take root. And uh, what happens is when, when you're faced with something, you either step into the fear or you run away from it. Fight or flight. And fight or flight is a survival uh, mechanism. But, and, and it's good, like, if you have a wild animal chasing you, right? You want to run. You don't want to, you don't want to, like, just stand there and get mauled. <laughs> that wouldn't make sense. But what I'm talking about is more for network marketing, internet marketing, that kind of thing. Fear of, of talking to people. Fear of doing videos, fear of writing, fear of doing presentations, just fear fear of uh, losing money, fear of being successful, fear of not being successful, things like that. So how do you overcome fear? Well, there's a two-step process, and the, and the first part is pinpoint the fear. Where is the fear coming from? Are you afraid of talking to people? Well, where is that fear coming from? Are you afraid of what they're gonna think of you? Are you afraid of how they're gonna see you, perceive you? Uh, where is it coming from? Where did it develop? Did it develop in your childhood? I mean, you, you gotta go back, you gotta pinpoint that fear. Once you pinpoint it to fear, the next step is to take action. Take action. So if you have a fear of talking to people, what shall you do? Well, you need to go talk to people. One of the things I had a fear of, and, and it's really, I know other people have this fear, but I look back at it, I'm like, it's the stupidest fear ever. And I'm not saying that your fear is stupid, but for me, it was preventing me from doing things that I needed to do. Now, that fear was going and chatting with people on Facebook, which is now like simple to me, it's actually fun. But back then it was horrible, like, oh, what am I gonna say? I bet you probably heard that before, right? What am I gonna say? I don't know what to say. I don't know what to talk about. What if they think I'm spamming them? Um, all kinds of things go through your head. What if, what if they think I'm stupid? Well, the best way to get over this and how I did it was I started talking to 25 people a day. Yes, 25 people a day. Was it easy? No. Did I want to do it? Hell no. I did not want to do it. But I knew it was something I had to do, so I took action. I took massive action. I did 25 a day. 25 people a day I connected with. So maybe, you know, you want to start at one or two a day. But the point is, take action, get the ball rolling. Now, another fear I had, which I don't have anymore, is making videos. Now, videos are something that I was terrified of doing. I'm a very private person, didn't want people to see me. Didn't, I was so concerned about what other people were going to think that I just didn't want to do a video. But one day I was watching something and uh, Mike Cohen's, uh, the guy does, uh, what was it, Traffic Geyser. He was saying how powerful video is. Video is the most powerful marketing tool there is. And right there I was like, I need to do video. And I did. I started. I got started. I did it. Yeah, it sucked. It was terrible at the beginning. But I did it. I even did exercise videos with me exercising in them. And let me tell you, that's if you're not comfortable on video, that's a big hurdle to overcome. 
So little by little, I kept doing it and doing it and doing it. And now I'm over 300 videos and it's simple. It's, it's not a big deal to me anymore. So maybe you're there and you're not sure about doing video. Maybe you're afraid. Maybe you feel like, oh, I don't know what, I, if I'm going to look good. My lighting's not good. Whatever it is, I, I don't sound good. I don't know what to say. Take action. Get started. Postponement is fertilizer to fear. Action cures fear. Did you get value from this video? If you did, please like, share, and comment about it. I do appreciate it. Please go ahead and check this out on my blog at paulgfarmer.com. Also, please connect with me on Facebook and on Skype. And I look forward to connecting with you. And I'll see you next time on the next video.